Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Siobhan, if you're new here, and we're moving to California. Running our way to a better time Sweet nostalgia gonna ease my mind In the shadows can you feel the just wanted to give you a little bit of a California update. I haven't talked that much about it at all. So basically we decided we were moving to California. Kind of on a whim, but not really. We've talked about it for the past six months or so. We just didn't have a set date. And basically everything started to line up that was telling us that it's time to go now. And that's kind of what we're doing. Um, and yeah, it's really exciting. So since we made the decision, it was actually a week ago yesterday is when we made the decision. So it's only been a week since we decided we're actually moving. Um, and we've actually gotten a lot done. We started apartment hunting. Um, and pretty much when we get an apartment and sign a lease, that's going to determine our move date. So we're aiming for September 1st um, and then we're going to take a week to like actually drive and get out there. We want to do more of a leisurely road trip um, just because we want to drive through like Colorado and Utah and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so that's the apartment situation. Um, we decided we're selling everything and just like coming with nothing. Because yeah, so we've spent the past week going through things our apartment is already looking empty oh and I wish I wish I even had like I'll have to like show you guys pictures I haven't even showed you guys what the apartment looked before so uh dang it's it just looks empty it looks like it looks not lived in like it was so homey before and we're just selling like all our home decor and the furniture and everything basically how the days go are sometimes I wake up and I'm really stressed out um, but not stressed out like so far this decision to move to California hasn't felt bad it doesn't feel forced it doesn't feel it's just sometimes it's stressful because I mean there's obviously a lot that we have to do before we leave um, so yeah there's this added element of just things that need to get done. And that's honestly where I get stressed out is just getting everything done. But what I found is that, you know, I wake up and I'm usually stressed about like one specific thing. So whatever that thing is, I just do. I'm just like, all right, in order to not be stressed. So for example, yesterday, I was very stressed out about budget. And so I sat down yesterday and I worked through my budget and now, I'm not stressed out about it anymore because I basically work through it and I did that you know with apartments if I start getting stressed about apartments I'm like alright I'm just gonna look at apartments and see what happens same with jobs it's basically just getting more clarity on all the situations uh, one of the reasons I get stressed and I think a lot of people get stressed is the unknown so just make it a little more known and you, you kind of feel like, for example, like, I mean, apartments, jobs, even budget. I don't, I'm not 100% confident. We don't have an apartment, but I feel better about it doing the research and looking more into it because you feel like you have more of a handle on the situation. You know, you're not just like sitting in the un unknown anymore. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much what I've been doing is chipping away a little bit every day um, I'm gonna be spending the weekends. I'm taking advantage of the weekends because I still have a full-time job So I only have the evenings during the week um, I'm gonna get a lot of stuff sold this weekend is the goal fingers crossed um, doing some cleaning and tying up loose ends um, And yeah, that's that's honestly the update so I can't wait to like take you guys on this journey with me. I know I haven't like officially introduced this video yet, so this is kind of the introduction. It's about to be 
a super crazy next few months and I'm so excited. So the sky gonna change, take me there to the good old days. Cause you know it's only gonna get better. Yeah, the seasons know when to change. Better weather don't last forever. Oh, you know things never stay the same. Never stay the same. Hey guys, I uh, just wanted to give you a little California update. Um, it's August 11th and I'm still stressed. <laughs> I literally was talking to my roommate about this because I mean it literally just comes and goes in waves. Um, some days I'm completely calm. I think it's the days that I don't get a lot done um, or I feel like I'm not making any movement that really stress me out. I made a list on my phone um, like a couple weeks ago and I haven't looked at it. I forgot that I need contact lenses um, and then I got an email that apparently I need to get my emissions on my car. Um, I'm bringing my car to California, but I don't want to register it in California because I don't know how long I'm going to be in California. So, yeah. Um, but I also don't want to drive my car all the way back to Maryland just to get emissions tested. So, yeah. Um... I'm literally just, I've sold a good amount of stuff so far, but I still also have a lot of stuff that I want to sell, so my major goal for this week is basically listing everything on Facebook Marketplace that I own that I want to try to get rid of, and then this weekend I'm going to make like multiple trips to Goodwill. Basically, anything that I know that I don't want and that I don't think I'm going to sell apartment update we have an apartment and we literally are just waiting our new landlord needs to talk to our old landlord just to make sure that we're good tenants which i mean we are she loves us so so we're not really worried about that it's just basically waiting for the approval and then we have an apartment and i'm so excited my roommate and i both are really excited about this apartment it's like it's just so cute and we have a balcony and it's exactly where we want it to be like yeah it's perfect so we're both really excited about that and honestly that'll just solidify everything because once we have the apartment the document signed we have a move-in date then we can plan everything else around that move-in date and that's all i got for you it's gonna get better. Never stay the same. it's gonna get better Today is my last day of work. I'm nervous, excited, happy, sad, honestly so many emotions today. It's like now that everything's fully coming together, plans are solidifying. Yeah, it's absolutely insane. In Insane. My desk is officially cleaned out. This is literally so bittersweet right now. update the house is a wreck so we're a week out from leaving it's i'm almost getting stressed that there's still stuff here and it's just like i need to get it out so i don't know if i said this already but what we're doing is we're literally just driving our cars out to california and we're not bringing anything with us so we have to get rid of everything um there's a couple things that i'm keeping um like sentimental items that i'll be keeping at my parents house but yeah, most of my stuff I'm just literally getting rid of. 
Um, I've been selling things on Facebook Marketplace for the past few weeks, and I've made about like probably 300 or so dollars. Um, I'm hoping to be able to sell my couch and my bed. Um, I'm, I'm also to the point where if I don't sell them, I'm just going to say they're free because I just need, I need them out. And I don't really have a way to transport them to anywhere. So it would just be easier if someone could come and like get them from me, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah. with the new sunrise. Oh, the rain, oh, the rain can't stay. I just ordered my mattress and bed. Oh my god. I feel like it hasn't been real until, I mean, it's all been real, but I just bought my first piece of furniture for my apartment. Freaking insane. Good old days. Cause you know it's only gonna get better. Yeah, the seasons know when to change Better Hey guys, I thought I would give you a little bit of an update Things are getting empty I took my shelves out of my bedroom So Basically just have my bed, I know Gotta go through like this stuff, but it's basically all getting packed Took my curtains down This is the current living room situation. Um, literally, you just have the couch left, and that's it. And I'm literally sitting here eating dinner with Milo watching TV. Oh, you know things never stay the same.